morning, good morning, good morning, hello, hello, hello to you. Hello friends, welcome back to The Rub with me, Lady Long. I'm so happy to see you and I'm so happy that you could join me. Let's put on everything we need to start our day. Are you ready? Let's put on our thinking caps. We're ready to think and learn. Show me your thinking faces. Hmm. Let's put on our looking eyes. Boop, boop, boop. We always stop and look at who's talking. Put on your listening ears. Click, click. We always listen and make good choices. Let's put on our calm body. <laughs> we keep our bodies calm when we're learning. Let's put on our kind hands. Show me your gentle touches. Yeah. We use our hands to help others. <laughs> now let's put on our inside voices. We are always quiet when someone else is talking. And when we're talking, someone else should be quiet too. Okay, friends, are you ready to sing the Days of the Week song? Look up at the board and sing with me. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. These are the days of the week. Help me find the days of the week. These are the days of the week. Help me find the day of the week. <laughs> Today is Wednesday. It's the middle of the week. What's today? Wednesday. What's today? Wednesday. What's today? Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Yesterday was Tuesday. Tomorrow will be Thursday. And Wednesday's right there in the middle. Look up at the board with me so we can find out what today's letter is going to be. <gasps> Look, there it is. It is uppercase X. Let's use our big voices to say hi to big X. Hi, big X. <laughs> Look, up on the board, it's lowercase x. Let's use our little voices to say hi to little x. Hi, little x. <laughs> x is such a special letter because it makes a very different kind of sound. The x goes x, x. <laughs> Let's say it together. The x says x. The x says x. Every letter makes a sound and X says ksk. <laughs> I am so excited because we get to learn about some of the exhilarating X words that we use in our English language. Let's get our basket and learn about some exquisite X words. Okay, friends, let's look into my letter basket at the exquisite X words we have today. Now, X is such a special letter, we're gonna have words that start with the letter X, that have X in the middle of it, and that have X at the end of the word. We're also gonna find out a word that starts with X, but makes a different sound than the X, X sound. Let's look into the basket and see. Ooh, one of my favorite X words. X for X-ray. X-ray is a special machine that we usually find at the doctor's office or the hospital or dentist's office. It helps us to see inside our bodies into the bones. And we can see if anything is broken. Here's a word that has X at the end. F. 
fox, a sly animal that lives in the woods. Fox is has X at the end of the word. Another word that ends with X is box. It also rhymes with box. <laughs> Boxes are used for lots of different things. We can put things in them to save it or store it. We put packages in boxes too to ship them or mail them around. My favorite thing to do with boxes is to build forts. <laughs> I like to color them and make them into other things. Oh, here's a cool word that has X in the middle of it. Hey, taxi. <laughs> taxi is a car or van that you can use to take you places. You have to pay the driver and it'll take you wherever you want to go. Make sure you're using your seat belts. <laughs> and here's that special X word I was telling you guys about. A xylophone. Xylophone starts with X, but it makes a different sound. Z -z -z. Almost like the letter Z. Xylophone is a cool instrument. It makes a unique sound and you can play it to make music. Here's our X words. I love the letter X. X. Friends, let's look up at the board and find out what shape are we gonna be learning about today? Do you see the shape? Hmm. It's pretty tricky. I see this shape sometimes on street signs. I also see this shape um, on birdhouses. It almost looks like the roof of a house. It's a pentagon. Can you say that with me? Pentagon. Yeah. A pentagon has five straight lines and five corners. Can you find some other things that are shaped like pentagons? Pentagon, the shape of the day. I'm excited because we're going to be learning about a new color. First, let's sing the color song. Are you ready? Sing it with me. Blue, red, yellow, and pink, orange, green, and purple. Blue, red, yellow, and pink, orange, green, and purple. These are the colors that we see every day. Blue, red, yellow, and pink, orange, green, and purple. Let's look up at the board and find out what today's color of the day will be. Look, do you guys know that color? It's purple. I love the color purple. Purple like pretty lilacs growing in the garden. A purple like Yummy grapes that grow on the vine. <laughs> There's lots of things that can be purple. What are your favorite purple things? Look down on the rug with me and let's look at some of the purple things that I found here in my classroom. Okay friends, let's look at my purple tray and see some of the purple things that I have here in my classroom. Here we have a purple pentagon. <laughs> Our color and shape of the day. I also have here some purple pom-poms, so soft. I use pom-poms all the time in different arts and crafts activities I do. 
I have here some toy purple fish, a purple dinosaur. <laughs> I also have a purple teacup. Would you like a spot of tea? <laughs> and some purple triangle magnets. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Take a look around your home and try to find some things that are purple. Friends, it's time to find out the number of the day. Day, day. <laughs> Ooh, I know this. I know this number, do you? It's a pretty big number. It's the number after 12, but it comes before 14. The number 13. I had so much fun learning about the letter X. <laughs> Making the funny sounds. <laughs> I also had fun counting to the number 13. And on the rug today, we learned about the color purple. <laughs> and the shape pentagon with five straight lines and five corners. <laughs> I had so much fun with you. Kiss your brain, because you're so smart. Now, pat your back and say, I'm the bomb diggity, because <laughs> there's no one like you. I know we had a lot of fun today, friends, but it's sadly time to say goodbye. Can you sing goodbye with me? Now it's time to say goodbye. I had much fun today. Hope to see you once again so we can learn and play. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me, friends, on the rug. And be sure to come back again to learn about a new letter. We'll be doing a different color and different numbers and different things on the rug with Lady Long. Thank you, and I see you next time. Happy learning.